Hi. Such a gentleman. Well, I like to try and be a gentleman, especially you look very elegant, very beautiful and sophisticated and classy. All for you. Well, I thank you very much indeed, but it wouldn't fit me. I, uh... Just an option. No, it's, 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 it's very lovely in your shoes. My yeah? goodness, they're lovely uh, knobbly bits mm -hmm. on them. Yeah, they're, uh, I was hoping you would not mention my feet, considering I wear, like, the largest size possible. So, I very... No, <laughs> no, no, no. I've, I've seen larger sizes in a high-heeled shoe than that. Are you sure? <laughs> size 11? Oh, no, yes. no, no, no. Not, not the height of the heel, my actual feet, though. Like a size 11? Well, that's good. Very rare. It, it's, yeah. I'm, a, I'm a... Sasquatch has the same feet. No, I... I do you have big feet? Oh, God, yeah. Well, that's great. That, I mean, so in high winds, you're like, no problem. Yeah. Or, um, or if I was a guy, maybe, you know, I'd be well endowed. Well, I had big feet. Well, but you're, you're clearly not a guy, so uh, don't, don't, it may, it'll be fine. Water skiing? Water yeah, skiing? Oh, I, I don't even need the ski. Yeah, you'd be like, come on, let's go! <laughs> be fine. Congratulations. Amazing. May I ask about your uh, your name? It's very unusual. Yes. It's, uh, where's it from, Van Santen? Um, it's Dutch. Ah, yes, I see. Dutch. I am 75% Dutch, 25% Norwegian. Wow, mm -hmm. good for you. Yeah. And that, uh, that's, um, so Dutch would be, have you been to Amsterdam? I haven't. Oh, haven't. You, you should go. Yeah. <laughs> I, I have, but I'm sure that's no surprise to anybody in this room. I, yeah, no, it's a fantastic place. Yeah. Beautiful city, Amsterdam. Yeah. yeah. Have you never been to Holland? Mm, no, I haven't. Actually, my, my grandparents came from, one side of my grandparents, came from Holland and, uh, settled in Minnesota and they are dairy farmers so so you grew up a dairy farmer I did I did grow up a dairy farmer uh, one That's... set of parents uh, one set of grandparents had a dairy farm and uh, milk cows and ones raised cows and pigs for meat so, oh so you're you're a yeah. good are you a vegetarian no <laughs> are you kidding me my family would never let me be vegetarian Do you still hear the lambs Santa? <laughs> That would be kind of because yeah no I don't know how well I'd be growing up. No? My wife grew up on a, a farm and she's kind of like very practical. It's good because she's used to being around large smelly creatures, yeah. so it kind of worked for me. <laughs> but I don't know how well I would have done. No, with that. no. We had to do all sorts of fun things like um, besides milking the cows, which was a fun task in and of itself. Did like, you use the electric milk? Yeah, you use, but, but you yeah. have to wash them and put salve on their udder during the winters, and uh, you. <laughs> I'm trying not to be really weird about this, and it's really hard. It's like not... our first date. I yeah, probably yeah, shouldn't like, tell you these things. Yeah, yeah. No, but uh, um, you, you rub the udders. Yeah, yeah, uh, and uh, you help cows give birth and all sorts of. How fun. do you help them give birth? Like drive them to the hospital or something? Um, <laughs> I wish it was. I wish it was that nice. No, you normally have to like reach down in and tie twine around a calf and then help pull. So it's that a very sounds like <laughs> polargeist. <laughs> you know when they had to hold on to the rope, Caroline. And then <laughs> Yeah, it was. Wow. Uh, yeah, it was a it was a very interesting childhood. So, so well, why did you get drawn into acting then? Was it just to avoid uh, you know large smelly farm animals? Because you're going to run into them here. I know. Um, no, I, I don't know if it's what I always wanted to. I wanted to write. That's what I was going to college for. Ah. And uh, acting kind of found me. And in that sense, I felt like it's what I was supposed to do. What uh, what college did you go to to write? Uh, I was going to Texas Christian University. Ah, I see. Yeah. Are you a Texas Christian? Um, <laughs> uh, wow, we're already talking about religion. No, no, no. Uh, we no. should go to politics next. No, no, no. We're, we're not no, talking I, about No, uh, I, I only went there for a year and a half. I, never I finished. see. So, um, but uh, yeah, I, I came out. So you're a Satanist then? Yeah, yes, exactly, saying. exactly. 100%. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> so uh, you were studying, was it creative writing? Um, uh, journalism. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. There's none of that left anymore, you know. No. Nah, it's just horses' asses saying whatever they like. <laughs> nah, it's true. I think back in the day, you know, when they had editors and stuff, it was very rare to find a good journalist now. Yeah. What do you read for fun, then? Um, or do you read for fun? Do, do I know how to read? Oh, I'm sure you know how to read. Come on. Um, uh, I, I read, I mean, I have friends who all suggest things. I read lots of scripts, obviously. Right, yes. Yeah. I suppose when I mean, you're doing that as an actress, yeah, you, you kind of do that all the time. So what do you do to relax, then, apart from, you know, massage uh, cows during the birth? <laughs> uh, That's the most relaxing Well, you're, you live in Los Angeles, right? <laughs> yes, I do. All right, so what I do feel like I'm never here, though. I mean, I, I'm always shooting other places like Russia or Berlin or... That's great! All Russia, sorts of cool places. Where have you been to in Russia? Moscow. Oh, I've been yeah. there, yeah. Have you been to Yaroslavl? 
Uh, no, what's that? It's uh, the oldest, the oldest city in all of Russia, and it's outside by probably five hours outside of Moscow. No, no, that's too far for me. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's far away from civilization. What is it, what is it like? Uh, in, in Moscow? No, no, I've been to Moscow. What? I know what it's in like Euroslavl. in Moscow. Yeah, Yaroslav. What's um, there? It was a lot of, like, abandoned homes and farms on the way out there. Yeah. And uh, it kind of reminded me of living in, in Minnesota. It's funny when you go to other countries and you think, wow, this looks like Texas, or, oh, this looks like Minnesota. Yeah, I know, yeah. I remember thinking that, but some very... I went to Kosovo once. I was like, wow, I, this kind of looks familiar. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Then I remembered I'd been there fun. before, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, And Berlin, I've never yeah. been to Berlin. I Berlin is awesome. Yeah, I've heard I it's it great. There. I want to go there, yeah. badly, yeah. Where do you go on vacations, normally? Scotland. Yeah? Yeah. Back home? Yeah, yeah. I go to Scotland a lot, yeah. yeah. But I'm, fr been. I'm from there. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, Have you ever been there? I haven't. Oh, you'd love it. Next time you can just pack me in your carry-on, I'll come with. No? I, I look, I'd be into it, but those other <laughs> members of the family, I think, are going to have something to say. Okay. So, I, I don't know. I'll take you know. my own trip. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, honey, what if uh, one of the cows has a baby? She'd be like, no. <laughs> no, that would be great. Uh, well, anyway, we're out of time. Okay. Uh, so, do you want to end this? Uh, awkward pause, bit of meditation, want to throw um, frisbees at my horse? That's awkward. not cool. No, let's do That's, an awkward oh, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. That's cool. Hey, whoa! Oh, I thought it was like a... It's not oh, a no, moment? No, it's a, it's a, not an oh, awkward pause. That's an awesome a pause. That's a completely <laughs> different thing. I thought it was that kind of moment. No, that's... A, that's a, no, that's a, not an awkward... Oh, well, that's again a little awkward now, I guess. <laughs> Wonderful. You would never have lasted at the Texas Christian <laughs> University. My mom's going to be really disappointed. Oh, see, you're, you're only kidding. It's fine. I'm only kidding. Wonderful. Mm. Mm. here with a message for oh hi yeah let's hold hands <laughs> <laughs> are you afraid don't be afraid i'm only pretending <laughs> bill clinton here with a message for the male voters in the swing states on november 6th be sure to vote okay the next part of the message is just for the women of america I mean, I, I can hang. <laughs> I'm good. We don't need a script. I'll just stand here. Uh-oh. <laughs>